At the previous chapters, we have accepted the fact that the height and the width of the SVG element were set to 100% of the user agent viewport. I have made this for a certain purpose. I could draw the graphic elements directly in the browser window, but the cases when the SVG element occupies the entire viewport of the device is very rare. Usually, you will use the SVG fragments that will be embedded inside the HTML document. In this chapter, we will examine a topic that is very difficult to explain. Usually, the authors avoid its explanation. They show a very simple way that helps to avoid the problem with misunderstanding of the subject. But this way doesn't lead to a complete understanding. I want you to know why these problems may arise and how they can be corrected. After this chapter, you will understand how simple the subject is.